What's up everybody, Ben the Realtor AZ here. Join me as we head to the Olive Mill in Queen Creek, Arizona. You gotta stay tuned. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for tuning in. My name is Ben Kesington. I'm a licensed realtor in the state of Arizona with EXP Realty. Hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and definitely hit that notification bell so you get notified every time I drop a new video. We're located in the Southeast Valley of Phoenix Metro, and we are in a town called Queen Creek. Okay, Queen Creek, Arizona was named one of the 10 best suburbs to live in in the entire United States. And we are at a local hotspot, a Southeast favorite, and that is the Queen Creek Olive Mill. Okay, it's a family owned business, been open since around 2005. They have their own farm, okay? They love to cultivate, they harvest, okay? <laughs> then make it go from farm to plate, okay? They produce their own olive oil as well and they produce some of the best, right? There's classes to the olive oil and they produce extra virgin olive oil. They support tons of local vendors in the state of Arizona and throughout Phoenix as well. And me and my wife, this is a favorite for us and my family. We love to go to the olive mill, all right? So I'm gonna just give you guys a few videos, a few cuts from me and my wife's date, date night recently, and then I'll jump right back into it. Oh, there it is.
All right, so you saw a few clips from me and my wife's date night. Me and my family, we love to come here, but definitely me and my wife like to be alone and get away from the kids a little bit, if you guys understand as parents. Now, what we had was the antipasta board, which had artisan meats and cheese, Piero, olive mix, and orange spicy beans, Chardonnay herbs, you know, uh, the Soretta's dark chocolate, marinated artichokes, and baguettes. And we also had some aged Italian wine and just listen to some live music and kick back and that's what I love about the olive mill the outdoor dining the fire pit and it's just a nice smooth kick back chill ambiance and you definitely got to check it out during monsoon season check this out <laughs> Love the rain here in the summertime during monsoon season as in the desert we need the cool down every so often but what i love about the olive mills they're open seven days a week they have all day brunch on sunday usually when my family and i go and like i said the outdoor dining with the fire pit they also have tons of choices to choose from from breakfast lunch dinner coffee teas soup salads they have tons of healthy choices they also have gelato they have jams from local vendors and different products. They have a spa products, soaps, uh, body washes, and things like that. So that's what makes the olive, olive mill so special and, and a local favorite is because of so many different choices to choose from. And it's not a chain. It's a family-owned business, and we love supporting our local businesses. They do tours as well. Check this out. Oil, or if you're not producing oil correctly. <laughs> it's, uh, it's, called, it's called pumice. And pumice has, we'll put it in a big pile, and we won't rape seed oil, any oil that starts. So again, the basil, uh, you might find this a little bit more peppery. Um, the shelf life of anything that we add to our... Into the machinery with the olives, and the machinery presses those things together. Okay, gotta love that brick oven pizza, and as you can see here, you can take samples of olive oil when you're inside the dining area and the shopping area inside the market, and you can sit down and have a bite to eat definitely during those monsoon. Uh, storms here in Arizona. Now, what I love about the olive mill is, like I said before, you're getting farm to plate. So almost everything that you see on your plate when you're sitting down and eating is food that they produced at this mill, right? They're raising their olive trees. They're producing their own olive oil. They're using almost everything that they're cooking with that they produced. Okay. And the food is delicious here, guys. This is a local favorite. If you talk to anybody in the southeast or a lot of people in Arizona, they should know <laughs> they should know by now. This is also a tourist attraction. People come here to go on the tours. People come here to try the olive oil and purchase it and take it home, which is the same thing that I do. I come here and purchase wine. I come here. I purchase the olive oil that I use and cook that you'll see on some of my backyard grilling videos i cook with nothing but olive oil um, you can also enjoy some fresh pasta here they have soups they have sandwiches they have salads there's so much to eat here and the food is delicious guys i'm this is not a paid promotion any place i go to i go to because that's where i love to eat and i just want to share that stuff with you guys so if you're ever in queen creek and you're visiting and you're looking for a place to eat I definitely will recommend to you if you're in the Southeast Valley in Queen Creek, you got to stop by the Olive Mill. Okay, delicious. The antipasta board is nice as well. If you just want to get out the house, listen to some live music, have a couple glasses of wine, 
um, with your date it's amazing go with your your husband your wife and just sit down and relax this place is very very enjoyable all right and they give lots of tours so our owner is Carrie Venturea came out here in 1998 open to the public in 2005 we have about 100 acres here and we have about 7,500 trees so we have 16 different varietals so it goes from Greek Spanish Italian all right you guys this place does get packed especially during the cool season late fall winter going into spring definitely on sunday brunch time you're gonna see this place packed to the gills but it's wonderful for families to come out and have the kids running all over the place great place to come and just enjoy a meal with your family now thank you guys for watching this video i'm gonna just show you guys some more of the sites around the olive mill look at the food options and show you some pictures and stuff like that and different plates and different food to choose from when you guys come out here but anyways you guys enjoy the rest of the video like it if you love it share it if you love it definitely hit that subscribe button i'll see you guys on the next one i'm out selling or investing in real estate, feel free to reach out to me via phone, text, or email. See you guys next time.